breaking news on the impeachment of President Donald J. Trump. The people, my people are so smart. And you know what else they say about my people? The polls. They say, I have the most loyal people. Did you ever see that? As stated in the Constitution, nobody is above the law, even our current 2016 President Donald J. Trump. Yes, in the trial, the jury and judges must not be influenced by the position that Mr. Trump has in government. Article 1 is adopted. Lawmakers will soon determine the particular laws broken and if any penalties must be applied. It is tragic that the president's reckless actions make impeachment necessary. He gave us no choice. Although the majority of our U.S. cases are held in state courts, these federal laws must be performed through federal courts. Yes, the exclusive and concurrent jurisdictions will be involved in the hearing of the case. Who sent his personal lawyer to Ukraine to investigate his political rival? Who fired an ambassador who stood in his way? Who conditioned a White House meeting on investigations that only personally benefited him and not the national interest? The answer to all of these questions is President Donald Trump. He didn't even need the investigation to be undertaken. Just simply announced to the public the smear of his opponent, the smear of his opponent would be enough. The defendant, President Trump, will insist on being tried in the federal courts, while those opposing him will partake in being the plaintiffs against him. Trump is currently being impeached for abuse of power and obstruction of Congress. We'll keep you updated on any further actions made in the courts.